So this can come off, but I usually just leave it on. It's um, it's fairly easy to uh, to work out there. You just sit down here, put your legs on this for for a grab. That and you're, you're stable. You can yep. Do stuff. Um, the uh, furler. Is that aluminum? The 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 strut that goes out. Yes. Yeah. And um, very really big and strong. Yeah. So um, when you take the mask down, I re I obviously have to unbolt the furler from the back. Sure. Right? But uh, I take the bottom off because it it weighs a lot. And if you don't support it well, you might bend the sections. It's not yeah. hard to do, but don't, I would probably not leave it on and take the mask off. Right. Take it off first, and then um, right. Okay, that's it thick. Two tracks, and they're what type of furler is it? Do you know? Um, One of the usual things is the Harkin. Furler X is another one. I'm not sure. It's In. a brand name. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And um, the uh, Denny has uh, sun protection, which is what's facing out here. And we can open the sail for this one. Um, this is a nice fortress, and the line is below, and I cover it with a half of a garbage can cover to keep the sun off of the line. Okay, that stays open like that. There's not is there a top for that or not? No. Okay. There is down here um if you want to feel it on the side I think I can bring it into view. This is you pump out, and it's kind of free, but it hooks up uh, in a normal fashion if you want to do pump out, but I don't usually do that. Okay. Okay. Okay, now the, uh, the ackers or struts are supported with the, the water stays, and I, I've i done chain. They had... Um, Just shroud, right? Just wire. No, they had... Um, um, you know, wire with, with swages. Yeah. And the bottom swage is sitting upside down in the water. I just didn't think that was a good idea. This mm -hmm. is, I think, much, much more, uh, more stable, less corrosion. Mm hmm. Okay. Mm hmm. So, uh, any other questions here? Now, you'll see also on the bowsprit of downhaul, which is this line. Um, it's advisable to uh, have it up tight when you're using the Jenny, otherwise you're putting stress on the blowing the thing off. But the reason that you would loosen it would be... Um, you want to bring it up, right? You can bring it up? Uh, can it be raised if you... Well, you can if you take the front bolt off and it hinges here, but why would you want to do that? Where's the front bolt? Oh, okay, okay. I see. Yeah, typically, I mean, the other, like the F boats, you have um, their stays up front, and you just slide to get to to get access to. The, but since you have a solid furler, um, typically they have a wire wire instead of a solid furler, and then you just pull it up, and then you can get access to the the furler and disconnect. But I, you know, I see. Well, I see I you got a very soft. Take it off. I put the thing. Yeah. Because you got all these sure. branches, but if sure. you just had to like change the line or the line got foul, which it doesn't do, right. you can go out on it. Now the reason that you would would uh, ease the downfall is that you cannot tighten this stay when that one's tight. Mm -hmm. That takes attention. This gets slack. Yeah. So yeah. you release that, and this tightens up. 
Right. Okay. So that's no, that's no big deal. I'll show you. I got you. Now gotcha. the um, the tightness of of either or the other, you know, they, you can adjust them with with uh, the um, you know the tightening of uh, the winch, the winches. Uh, anyway, the tight the tightness of of what? Is, what are you talking about? The Locking on the name, but anyway, there's a thing that has a it's oblong with holes to tighten up the head stay with it. It's a, like a no, it's a, it's a like oh the sh the shroud. It's a turnbuckle. Turnbuckle, thank yeah. you. But um, what you really tighten the system up with is the the two rear shrouds. So you tighten them, they tighten up. 